Hello everyone. Thank you so much for watching my video. Today we are playing our Sim Cell versus Student Loan Debt, where we are trying to see how many degrees my Sim Self can get with the same amount of student loan debt that I have in real life. Last time we played, we just finished out our first semester. This is our second semester, and we are diligently working on our homework right now. We finished our first semester, we got all A's, wee! And with that too, we took out a whole new set of loans to start the process of getting our second semester squared away. And now we have, I think, $14,000 in debt. I can put a clip in right here from the last episode that said how many, how many monies we have taken out at this point. If we do this and we move forward, we're officially $14,570 in debt. I'm going to go over the classes because last time I said I do that. So let's dive into it. I can find it right here. Okay. So we're still studying psychology at this point, And the first class that we're working on right now is this one that starts at 11 a.m. tomorrow. And that is Secrets of Body Language. And it's supposed to emphasize our skills for charisma. And we have a final exam for that class. And the secrets of body language, in addition to providing no, in addition to providing a mother load of nonverbal cues and hints as to a person's feelings, body language serves more serves some very important purposes when studying psychology. While others focus on the person exhibiting the body language in question, this course questions those very examiners, asking why they perceive certain signals the way they do. And then after that, we're probably going to have to focus on our next class, which is also on Wednesday. That's from 3 to 425. And for that one, we have to also take a final exam. So for this one, it's have a seat, clinical psychology basics. For students that will be looking to turn their psychological education into business, this course explores the basics of clinical psychology, along with some studies on recent advancements in patient treatment and mental wellness. Our other classes we have on Tuesdays and Thursdays. So let me look at those. So from 1.30 to 2.55, we have, but why? Intermediate Sociology. <laughs> Doing really good. This is the first time I've read today, so <laughs> bear with me. But why? Intermediate Social Psychology. And also works on the scale of charisma and we'll have to give a presentation. So supported by a number of interesting and exciting i don't know why it keeps doing that it keeps like skipping it every time i try to read it's really weird it must be something going on with my mouse i'll just keep my hand on the mouse and it should be okay supported by the number of interesting and exciting in class experiments using the class as the social group being experimented on this course provides insight into how our behaviors change and adapt when exposed to group dynamics and then our last class here, which is from 3 to 425 Tuesdays and Thursdays, is push that button, making decisions. Push the button. What are you doing? I'm just playing, play along. Come on, push the button. Yeah, come on, push your button. Blow everybody up. Yeah, blow everybody up. Push the goddamn button. Push the goddamn button. You heard what she said. Do we have a deal? Should you take this job? Do you want to go out? Life is full of decisions and it can often feel like we are making them at random. Not so. This course uses the science of psychology to tease out and teach students that what mental forces go into each and every decision. It's just telling us about social bunny. Okay, so we must have finished that homework. Great, great. Let's do the next one. So that's have a seat, clinical psychology. All right. We acquire the logic skill, so Tegan's new skill in logic will allow her to play card games, chess, and use scientific equipment. As the skill increases, the chance of winning games is also increased, and new interactions will become available on the microscope and observatory. Wonderful. Meet new people. Who's this person? We got good compatibility with Misaki. Do we know Tamati? Well, we must. So we'll have her finish her homework and then we'll, okay, take a pill and chill, ma'am. 
There is one thing that we have to do. So we have to take a final exam. I'm not going to have her study for that until last minute. But we have to like give a presentation and submit a paper. So we probably want to like start working on those things first. Just because I'm sure they'll take a bit. So we'll work on the presentation next. We'll finish up here and then we'll go back to our place and start working on that. Okay, we reached logic le level two. Tegan can now collect plant samples and analyze them under a microscope. She can also discuss logic with other sims. Woo! Great, okay. We're gonna have her head back to her place. Oh good, the place is still just as filthy as it was before. Wonderful, glad no one cleaned. Why bother? All right. Let's get this presentation out and about. Capture the information. Should she sleep? Yes. I'm only going to have her sleep for like a couple of hours though. <laughs> Just by the end, she's going to be totally drained. It was like the first semester and I'm like, yeah, you're going to do all of these things really quickly. Rapid succession. Let's go. Ooh, level up. We leveled up in our Christmas skill. We're now a three. Tegan can now donate to online charity, practice pickup lines at a mirror, and can flatter other sims. We're definitely not going to be donating to online charity because after, you know, a few semesters, we're going to run out of money. And also, too, we do not have a job right now. Wonderful. I'm going to have her eat something. I think... Good. Our little fridge is right here. We'll just have a quick meal. Our sip midnight. Do we all have our copy of Threat Level Midnight by Michael Scott? Yeah, yeah. All right, let's get this started. What is that? Is that a drink? Some of these I don't know what they are. I was just like gonna look for like a quick meal like ramen or something like that. But I don't know if they actually like have ramen now that I am looking. Cucumber slices, cold cuts, chips, cheese crackers. Plate of just whole grain bread. I'm gonna do that funny power sip midnight just because I don't know what it is. I love that she's doing her homework right now. It's adorable. Oh, it's just like an energy drink. I guess that makes sense. I wonder if it'll help with her hunger. What time is it? Okay, it's 4.52. She should probably go to sleep. Oh God, it did not help with her bladder though. Looks like a grape soda, you know? Well, it kind of helped with her hunger a little bit. Now she has to pee really badly. You're just going to leave it. Yep, right there. Perfect. Right where it belongs. Oh, was that a wolf or... Okay. There you go, pee. That's great. Great, great. Great stuff. And then I don't know what time that first class is at. And then 11 a.m. So if she goes to sleep now, she could technically sleep for like a solid five or so hours, which I feel like is, you know, pretty good for a college, college time. So we'll have her sleep. Good night, little Tegan. Is everyone sleeping? Wow. So Tegan Grossman's university term begins today and will last for five weekdays. I don't want to lose track of time. Sorry, I'm going to pause it. She should take a look at her class schedule and plan on when to do her homework and study, when to eat, and if there's time left over, when to kick back and have some fun. Okay, go. Onward. Get to, get to class. Harvest fest. Never heard of her. We're not having it. We'll have her jog faster. Don't you just wish sometimes that there was like a fast forward button like this? <laughs> Could just move it along. She's off to class. Learn great things. Make good choices. Great. I'm so glad that she did her work appropriately. We'll bike here. Oh good, someone is there now. We'll get some sweet bread. Actually, we won't get some sweet bread because this dude's here now. We'll get the caprese salad. Yep, just wash your hands a couple of times. That'll help. Help with the general hygiene. It's like a Kesha shower. Oh my god! Hi, Bree. Um, let's ask her how she's doing. Oh, think well. Okay, so her class begins soon, so we'll have her just go to class because she just need to go eat something. What are you doing, Tegan? Why are we just sitting here? Just holding her notebook. Are we gonna... Okay. She just... What is she doing? Why is she walking in a full-blown circle? Are you gonna sit in this chair instead? <laughs> what is happening? Okay, great. Stop having a conversation. You have to go to class. You have 15 minutes. What are you doing? Come on, girl. <laughs> She's playing musical chairs, but like alone. 
Maybe we can ride around. Let's ride around. Let's do that. That'll help. Our fun will increase, and then we'll start working on our homework for the next next classes tomorrow. Ooh. <laughs> We're flying. We're going so fast. Ooh. Perfect. All right, and we'll sit, and then we'll start working on what is our next class. We have... So we'll do, but why? Intermediate social psychology. Then once she's done with that one, we'll have her do the decision one. Make it happen, girl. Make it happen. Now, where are you going? Okay. She didn't like that chair. The cushion was just off-putting. Why is everyone standing around? It's like we're standing waiting for a presentation that isn't happening. Ooh, her computer's fun. She saw me eyeing it. She was like, I'm putting this back in my pocket. Yay, we're doing the next one. So we'll do this, we'll go home, we'll take a swear, we'll take a shower, and we'll wash our face, and then we'll work more on our presentation. Oh, hi. Hello again. Ask, we'll ask them about, our, about their degree. Ask them about our degree. In a frame. So Tegan has learned that Masaki is majoring in language and literature at the University of Brightchester. What a wonderful thing to major in. She's like, I hate clouds. She's very confident about her answer, too. We've reached logic level 3. Tegan now has a chance to gain slightly more logic scale from chess and card games than normal, which is quite cool. Nice! We did it! Okay, it's only 10 o'clock. It's quite late. That's fine. We're going to go here. We'll bike here, which will increase our fun. And then we'll go to the bathroom. We'll shower, wash our face. And then we'll work on our presentation until super late at night again, because we have mostly afternoon classes. The benefit of having afternoon classes means you can stay up super late and work until you can't work anymore. This is a good scene, isn't it? You can really see where Tegan is, what's happening, where she's going. Oh, nope. I mean, she just sped off. <laughs> it's okay. The bike is the greatest thing because it, like, solves the fun problem very quickly, which is wonderful because I'm guessing... I mean, I don't know. That guy was running really fast. Um, Yeah, I know. I know. We're working on it. Yep. Use the toilet. Use the loo. We'll shower and shave. We'll also... We'll wash our face, too. Apply facial cleanser. And you know what? We'll... We'll well, I mean, there's no point in concealing your acne. It's late at night. Yeah, conceal your acne at 11.22 p.m. <laughs> we'll brush our teeth, too. We can ask for feedback from Tamati. Wait, no, we're not going to ask for feedback first. We'll do all this other stuff, and then hopefully he'll still be awake late into the night. Oh, my God, let's ask Misaki. She'll be helpful. We cleaned her face, so we'll probably be feeling a little bit better now. Great. That's good. Yeah, swear at her. I like how she's not even facing the presentation. She just looked at it once and was like, I have all this feedback now. Um, so we did ask her feedback, which was great, and now we'll refine it and organize. Her character just is like swearing every five seconds. Tegan's like pissed. So Tegan can now perform a smooth apology and cheerful introduction to other sims. Nice. Right, Tegan's term presentation looks great. She can continue fiddling with it, but at this point, further refinement will only serve to better her understanding of the course without making the presentation any better. Wonderful. All right, we're not going to talk to that guy. Um, he's adorable looking, but we're not going to talk to him. We are going to have a ham and cheese sandwich, and then we're going to get into bed. <laughs> it's very cute, though. Hello. Are you dressed in a suit? It's 3.46 a.m. Oh. No judgment. I mean, wear whatever you want, but it's 3.46 a.m. on a Thursday. Oh, is she going to sit back out there and talk with him? It looks like it. She's like, I know I brushed my teeth, but this ham sandwich is calling to me. Oh, see ya. It's awkward. It's so depressing. It's harvest fest and we won't even be able to like Okay, yeah, we can't decorate ignore the just ruling university housing, but there's gonna be gnomes. Amazing. And there's connivial spirit. 
Are there gnomes? I don't see any gnomes. Oh, shoot. She has class in about an hour. All right, go forth and prosper, young one. Hey, who did this? <gasps> oh my god, it looks awful. Uh, my face. You can't see my face. My mouth is agape. I don't understand. What? Who did this? <gasps> oh, that's trash. That's trash, I tell you. We'll have to we'll have to fix it and then get back at some people. Okay. What are you doing? I don't think that you're part of this school, are you? Oh no, it's at 1.30. Get it. Go, Tegan. Oh my god. She stresses me out sometimes. Someone else is also late, Misaki. <laughs> Okay, we all right. Wonderful. She did great work. We're going to have her bike over here. So bike here. Oh, good. She was able to go to the bathroom while she was there. Great. One last thing that we have to do. We'll have her bike and then we'll pick up some food at the at our usual location and we'll start working on our other homeworks for tomorrow, which is already going to be Friday. Kind of crazy. Weeks are speeding on by. <laughs> We have a mission. Our mission is to accumulate as much debt as possible. <laughs> Easy peasy. Um, yeah, let's. We'll go with Masaki. No one is here to feed us, so that's okay. Not a big deal. We will just start on. Yeah, we'll do our homework together. That'll be cute. Yeah, I'm hungry too. I get you. Oh, we're not going to sit at one of these giant tables together. Now we're just going to be as far away from each other as humanly possible. Great. Um, hey, so this might be a bad time, but I came back to our place and I seem to have um, locked myself out. Silly me. So could you come home? Like, no rush, but right now would be good. The incompetence. Yeah, I could. Ooh, there's a holiday menu. <gasps> Let's get a turkey dinner. That's so cute. What a vibe. I love that. Okay, we'll stop eating. We'll get some food. And then we'll go back to our dorm to give that guy space to have the dorm. <laughs> I'm really good with like the English language today. I'm crushing this. One turkey dinner, please, with a little bit of spice. Thanks, bro. Maybe we can have, what's a connivial spirit? What does that mean? Oh, being thankful. Oh, maybe we can thank our friend. Okay, bye. Just kidding. No, we can't. Oh, be thankful. Okay. Oh, hey, you're here. Oh, you need help getting into the dorm. Well, you're the one who's going to go with me when we go and go to the dorm. We're gonna go back to housing and then we'll work on our homework here, I guess. I feel like we're a little bit behind right now. It's stressing me out. Great. We're back. We're here with our bike, ready to go, ready for anything. All right. Let's sit here and then we'll start doing our homework, which I already forgot what it's called. I think it's that Secrets of Body Language one. It is. It's Secrets of Body Language. Okay. Oh, she's in a food coma from eating a grand meal. That was fun, though. I feel like they should enable this one just because, to me, that makes sense. And this one was disabled before, but now it's saying that we should decorate. Oh, we're all going to sit together. That's kind of cute. And we also have our other homework to do. It's okay. I know you're going through a time, but this is something also that we have to do. Okay, so have a seat. Clinical psychology basics. We have to also do that too. Oh, she's so sweet, Misaki. She's just cleaned the toilet. She seems so nice, like our previous roommate. Maybe we can have her go to bed a little bit earlier, wake up a little bit earlier, and then go and do her presentation before her first class. First class is at 11. Kind of hoping it wouldn't take more than two hours to do. I feel like it's risky. She could also do that the following day. Wait, no, it's Friday. So she'd have to do it. Oh, shit. 
Okay, we're gonna have her let, let her play a little bit of the Sim Shuffle. Ooh, what kind of cookie you having? A flirty heart cookie. That's fun. All right, we'll have her start working on her turn paper. Because she does have to do this next too. <laughs> this is so stressful. I don't think I've ever sped through a Sims game so much. Like I don't even play on like short lifespan. Short lifespan is like way too chaotic for me. But I feel like right now I'm playing on short lifespan because of like how quickly I'm moving through the days just to be like, okay, we have all this stuff that we have to juggle. <laughs> Are y'all stressed? I imagine if someone could play the violin that fast. You're crushing it, dude. I'm pretty sure that's the guy that took out the violin when I started doing this presentation last time. This guy's gonna play the violin in the middle of our presentation, which is kinda rude. We reached logic level four. Tegan can now read intermediate logic books. Wow. No, oh, our harvest West was awful. Well, that was predictable. There was no gnomes around. Obviously, that's the real problem here. Oh, we can give our presentation at 8 a.m. Okay, let's, we'll do that. I feel like that would be good. We'll take a quick shower. And then we'll apply facial cleanser, brush our teeth, and we'll head to bed. Perfect. I just want her to at least write the paper. What time is it? It's like 2.46. We can sleep for like three hours, right? It's fine. I'm sure that won't have an impact on her education at all. It's Friday. It'll be fine. We'll just take like one of those massive energy drinks. We'll feel great about it. God, it feels like everything's in the yellow. All right, it's fine. It's fine. It's totally the chillest thing in the world. Okay, we're gonna go to the bathroom, lickety split, and then uh, let's get some cereal, and then after that we'll go. I think that'll give us enough time. I don't know. <laughs> Who's this guy? Look at him smiling, smiling away. He's like, I'm a professor. Woo! I'll give final presentation. Go, Keegan. Go, Tegan. Yep, bring your cereal and this whole outfit. Oh, I thought she was just gonna go in her PJs. <laughs> Alright, run! Bring your whole cereal! Go! Go! Oh no! Okay, okay. Oh, she's invisible. Wow, I didn't know a presentation would accomplish such things. You can just see the splash of her toes. I don't know how to handle this glitch. Oh, yeah, I'd say something went wrong. Does she come back or <laughs> we just can't see her anymore? Oh, okay, good. She's, oh, she's so angry. <laughs> Me too, that was confusing. We'll just save it real quick so we don't lose our progress here. She's really happy. She did her presentation. It's all done. I think we did homework for all of our classes. I'm pretty sure. Homework complete, homework complete. Yeah, we just need to write our term paper and then we have our final exams and that's it, dude. We like sped through this quite literally. Okay, so she reached charisma level five. Tegan can now start social network on a computer. She can also practice storytelling at the mirror and perform a flirty introduction on other sins. Okay, she's miserable, so. What we can do is we'll have her take a quick bike ride. Where's your bike? Oh god, your bike's not here. What do you mean? Where's your bike? I bet you anything. It's back here. Yep, yeah, it's just in the middle of the room. Oh my god, Tegan. <laughs> what the hell? Oh no. Oh. Oh no. What's wrong? Hold on. Oh my god, stop. What's wrong? Oh no, is she sick? Tegan, this is not the time. It's Friday. I have an idea. We're going to travel here. And then what that'll do is it will give us most likely our bike. And then maybe we can do like a quick loop. A quick loop to do. That's not in here. She's going to 
play a quick game of this and then go to class afterwards, I guess. When is her next class? Oh, use the portable computer. I know we're having some sick conversations, but our socialization doesn't need help right now, Tegan. Other aspects of our personality do. Um, play game. Uh, play Sims Forever. There we go. Now we're both going to be having a grand old time. You and your zebra stripes. I feel so bad that she's sick. Can she order, order some medicine? Yeah. Let's purchase two for good measure. We're down this medicine. This guy will not leave us alone. I'm sorry, Tamati, but pretty sure that you played the violin that one time that we were trying to give a presentation. Please don't let... What the heck? Stop with the... Stop. Stop it. I'm getting so mad. No. This is our PC. You can't just take our PC. Okay, go, Tegan. I'm sorry. You don't deserve to have any fun today. I'm angry at her. No fun for you. Our zebra print lady. Absolutely ridiculous. Yeah, take a swig of that. You feel a little bit better? We'll have her go home to get her bike. I thought she was going to kick him. <laughs> okay, ride around on your bicycle. Yeah, bike here. Do that. Look at that fun meter, though. That thing goes up the second that she's having a good time. Yeah, you know what'll make her even happier? We'll go to the bar and we'll go and get french fries. Oh, yay, french fries. French fries make everything better. It's Friday, so we're done with classes and now we just have to... What are you doing? Hey, you don't have to do that right now. Hey, Pedro. Nice pants. All right. Let's change our outfit. I think we already had like a fun... Our outfit back in the day. We did this cute little number here. We'll do that. Nice fall colors. Okay. Oh, wait. Hold on. Let's go shave our legs real quick. It's all good. We're just going to do a quick little shave. We're going to shave our leg hair. And then we'll, we'll wear this outfit and we'll go. Oh, no. She cut herself. That's the worst. Okay. Stop cutting yourself. You're using an old razor. That could be the first problem. Perfect. Okay, we look so adorable. Great, let's go. We're gonna call up our gal pals. It's only seven o'clock, but we're hungry. No, don't eat that. Don't eat that. Okay, we're gonna bring Bao for sure. Our friend seems to be in a costume. Our roommate, Marissa, she... I wonder if she's joining the spirit squad and if she'll show up in that costume. She better. I love it. Um, we'll invite our enemy. Just kidding. We're not. We're compatible, but I'm still mad. Um, let's invite Bree, of course. I mean, we could invite Anya, um, even though she hates us. Oh, cool. We should also meet some people, too. She does not. Anya does not look happy. Oh, there's people around us. Okay. Oh, Bree. We can do, I'll do a funny introduction, and then we'll also do a funny introduction while we do our homework. She looks really mad. She is very upset. <laughs> oh, hey. So also, I'm determined to be Anya's friend because she seems really angry and she doesn't like us very much. But you know what? It's okay. I think that we can get her to like us. I mean, who... Who wouldn't like us? Look at us right now. We're adorable. We're just on our bike, having a great time in the middle of our dorm in a towel. And she's like, yeah, that's the problem. Okay, let's get to know her because I feel like that might help us have better conversations with her. Oh, there's Marissa, our roommate. She's relaxed, but she's always angry. She's real chill about being super pissed off all the time. You bara. Huh. What's funny is it says that we're compatible, like we would get along, but we're never getting along. I don't understand. Ah, ask her about how her day's going. Maybe that'll help. Oh, think well. Oh. <laughs> I think we're like the only ones here. It's pretty. Oh my gosh, our good friend is here. Ask her how she's doing. Uh, 
mom will ask about her day. And then, you know, let's get to know her a little bit. Shearsha! Bella Balloon. Hoo-hoo, Harpin. She's brilliant. Invite right, Luna. Oh my god, Misaki. I can't believe I almost forgot Misaki. How dare I? All right, let's go. Oh, we can't go because we're not playing. Oh my god, gal pals, await. Oh let's do it. All right, we're going to go to Pepper's Pub. Perfect. Everyone looks great. Oh, yep. I know you're hungry. We're going to get... We're going to order food. We're going to order our favorite, which is french fries. Anya's angry as usual. She's really calm and collected and relaxed in enjoyable situations. Oh. Okay. Our bartender <laughs> ran away the moment we entered this space, which is unfortunate. Hey, Lilith. Welcome back. Um, are you going to run away again the second I ask for some french fries? Don't know where I'm going to ask for these french fries. Oh, good. The furthest away bar stool. Thank you. Put that in our pocket for later. Let's order a drink for the group. We're going to order $72. Oh my god. <laughs> we should order a root beer float. What's the cheapest thing on the menu? A water. <laughs> Just get everyone a water. Hey guys, first drinks on me. We're going to have water. <laughs> we'll do vodka soda. Oh, floating glass. Oh, we're drunk. We had one whiskey sour or whatever, and we're already drunk. Oh, wow. She's like fighting. I'm not even doing anything. No, she's like grabbing another plate of french fries. She's gonna eat her french fries and pee like a champion. We still can't order a drink from this guy. He's just in the way at this point. Like, are you just going to stand there? Can I ask you to make me a drink? What's your name? Who are you? Who are you? Hello? Keith. Hey, Keith. Hey, Keith. Hey, Keith. Can you make a drink, Keith? Thanks. Um, I'll take another vodka soda. It seems to be doing the, the trick for today, I'd say. Okay, where are you going? Wait, what? What's happening? Oh, she's going to go play ping pong. With a cute guy. Walk with so much confidence. Oh wow, he is beautiful. Card. Hey Ricard, what's up? Oh shit. Oh no. Oh no, come on, Tegan. Oh, okay. He didn't get it either. He didn't get it either. Oh, shoot. <laughs> she completely dropped it behind her. Oh my gosh, yes. Drink up, butter butt. <laughs> Whoa, so much confidence. Dang. Oof. Okay, that's okay. We only have to get one more. Oh, yeah, we won. And beer pong is done. What a good game. Game goes to Tegan Grossman with a score of four. Sorry, Ricard Ambrose. Better luck next time. Oh, how are we doing? Just holding on. Just gonna eat another plate of french fries. <laughs> All the people that we originally invited are just gone now. Like, they always leave. Probably because we were getting in a fight almost right away. Okay, it's 3 a.m., so we're probably going to head back. I would say that that was quite successful of a time. She had fun. She got in a fight. She won beer pong against an attractive dude. 
she'll probably call later. Let's go in here. We'll just we'll apply some facial cleanser, brush our teeth. We'll just go to bed. We'll just take a nice little sleep after that. We'll call it here. So I think I'm going to end this episode here. I'm trying to make it so that I don't do like really, really long um, episodes just because then I end up editing for like two or three weeks and it takes forever. So <laughs> um, I'm trying to make it so that they come up more frequently and I have more stuff to work with. So I've been playing for a little over an hour at this point. So with that said, I'm going to leave it here and... Yes, thank you so much again for joining. If you like this video or videos like this, please give it a like or comment. Um, subscribe if maybe you haven't already and you want to continue to play video games with me here. And yeah, thank you so much for joining. And if you like video game channels, my brother and I also have a gaming channel called J&D Plays. That'll be on the end card after this uh, conclusion is finished. And we usually play on Saturdays. We play kind of scary games, nostalgic games too. Um, so feel free to check those out as well if you enjoy that and are on Twitch by any chance. And as usual, keep it simple, and I'll see you in the next one.